and tonight a solemn tribute on the streets of Cleveland. You see here Cleveland police officers parading to honor their fallen and then gathering at the Cleveland Peace Officers Memorial, which now has a new name etched on it. The law say grief other families know so well. There's no form of currency that can ever repay the debt owed to our fallen police officers. We call upon Almighty God to be with us. Or their families who live every day without them. As we remember all of those who gave their lives for our safety in this great community in which we live. But Friday morning, the city of Cleveland taking time to say thank you to officers like Vu Nguyen, who collapsed and later died after a training exercise in 2018. Losing a family member that was an officer and that died in the line of duty is a very um, hard thing to go through. And when you get to come to these events and see all these different people that are here to support you and be there for you, it, it's really moving. The wins? Unfortunately, know all too well how Detective James Skernovitz's family feels. The 22-year veteran was killed in the line of duty just eight months ago, his family laying a wreath at the Cleveland Peace Officers Memorial, where his name is now written. It's nice to be around like another family that like knows what it's been through and like you can like talk to them about it if you need to and stuff. During the service, a new recruit class paying their respects also. A sign that while many police departments are struggling to attract talent, Chief Calvin Williams says that isn't the case for CPD. We're fortunate here in Northeast Ohio. We have a lot of folks that uh, see the call, uh, that know the importance of policing and having good officers from our community actually police our community, and we haven't had that difficult a time of recruiting. He says his officers would gladly give it all for the land. Police officers are out there to protect our, uh, our folks in our community, period. Uh, protect and serve, that's our motto. And, you know, without police officers out there doing that, you know, uh, I, I shudder to think what might happen in our society. And today's event capped off a series of events for Cleveland Police Week.